Hey you guys, the Kid Gaming here. Today we are well we're playing NBA 2K16, but right now this is just like a preview video of how to, how do you like successfully win road to the playoffs. So I'm just gonna show you guys what I suggest of the players that you should get. So right now I have passed like to go to the the eighth seed and to advance to the seventh seed. So right now I'm on the seventh seed right now. All that good stuff. So let me just show you like the lineup that I had. So this may work for some people. So this is the lineup I had. So I had a Marcus Smart. So this Marcus Smart was like so helpful for me along the way. So you honestly need like an all around player to like pass this. You do like a J.R. Smith is also good. So someone you can shoot threes in the clutch. So we can shoot mid range shot. But well, this is like the perfect one that I got. You also need a couple of seven footers. So right here I got um him. He's a seven foot three, I believe. Oh, seven foot four, excuse me. And then I have another seven footer right here. He's like seven two. No, seven three, okay. So they're like strong, you know, seven three. So I got two seven footers. So there's like rebounds are never going away. Like they're over they're staying off the bench and on the bench so here we have a couple of three-point shooters i have um like people who are like open three-point shooters we have him we have sasha willow Willi chick i believe i apologize if i get your name incorrectly hello turkaloo He's pretty nice, Jordan Farmer, and the new addition to my, my crew was Bryce Cotton and Steve Nokic. I didn't really use Steve Nokic a lot, but this guy, you seriously need to get this guy. He's like one of those people that you'll be like, how is this guy uh, bronze? You would expect him to be like a, a 60, I mean like a 74. Like the way he plays. Like people who should be 70s should, would be like He's pretty nice. He's pretty nice. Jordan Farmer, if you know how to use him, he can be like one of the best players. So then again, so what you need is a seven or seven footer for your center. Then you need a power forward. You can shoot threes. I would suggest some um, Hedo Turkoglu. Then you're gonna need a crafty point guard. I I would suggest Marcus Smart. And shooting guard, you just need like a J.R. Smith. Actually, it matters. If you don't want Marcus Smart, there's other good point guards. But if you seriously, if you're in a need for a shooter, I would suggest Jarrett Smith or Iman Shumper. He, they are silvers, but if they play like 90s what they're shooting. So you should seriously like go and get them. But right now, this is going to be my, my seed 7 team have my three gold players they might change i'm a little skeptical of paul george being in the lineup but we'll see if he can carry himself my bench is pretty like sharp now you have jj reddick a sharp shooter rudy gobert uh someone who can pretend to protect the paint a lot he can work on his speed i don't think we have any shoes for that or do we stamina so anything that can help him but Kobe has the pass accuracy. You serious? So I have like three big men who can like defend. We have, I'm not sure if um, Patrick Beverly is a shooter, but I know Jared Jack could be one. And we have um, a new school K KG, Kevin Garnett. So we can apply a shoe to him. Oh, oh we're kind of. Okay. So I, I believe that improved the rebound. Oh, yes, it did. So offensive rebound. Well, defensive rebound is pretty nice. You have Aaron Gordon. So pretty much, yeah, guys. So pretty much that's it. I, I haven't really started on my, my career yet, but i just been focusing on my team. With all that good stuff, I'm, I'm really glad that we can do this kind of stuff. So be sure to like, subscribe, and definitely leave a comment. My name is Akita Gaming, and all you have to do is stay awesome.